Today, Governor Greg Abbott addressed the power grid as we approach some dangerously cold temperatures looming. So he said the grid will likely face its peak demand again Tuesday and Wednesday. Fox 4 Stephen Dial joins us now with more. Stephen. Sound like a broken record when we hear about extreme below freezing temperatures. Instantly, people in Texas, their mind goes to, will the light stay on? Governor Greg Abbott today saying that this is nothing like winter storm Uri and we will be okay. I know a lot of people are concerned. Is the power going to stay on? From the start of an emergency management press conference Friday, Governor Greg Abbott said he realized Texans have concerns. From Saturday to Wednesday, state officials say the entire state will experience below freezing conditions. Abbott said while the power grid operated by ERCOT is fully prepared, they are predicting tight conditions after the MLK holiday. We are expecting Tuesday morning and Wednesday morning uh, to be the tightest times for the ERCOT power grid. Pablo Vegas leads ERCOT. He says because there will be little precipitation statewide, renewable energy like wind and solar will perform normal. Vegas says that changes with winterization also has power generators more prepared. We've completed uh, nearly 1,800 weatherization inspections across power generation and transmission facilities over the last couple of years. We're on track to do 450 this winter alone. Abbott echoed that statement, saying this is a different type of storm compared to winter storm Uri, which resulted in the state being in the dark for days. It will last for several days, uh, but it will not be the, the anything close to what we experienced during winter storm Uri. We are much, much more prepared uh, for this than we were for winter storm Uri. As of Friday, looking at the forecast, ERCOT says we will not go into any conservation calls. We do expect the uh, ERCOT grid to be normal conditions throughout this weather event. Uh, there's not an expectation of an energy emergency and we are not calling for conservation at this point in time. Now things can change. Now, ERCOT and Governor Abbott, they were quick to say, if your power goes out, first contact your power utility operator. So the different companies that you pay your power bill to, they say the ice, possible ice and possible strong winds can down power lines and tree limbs. They say if your power goes out, do not think it's ERCOT or the grid's fault. We'll have to wait and see, guys. People I'm are just sure. going to be prepared. We'll, <laughs> we'll figure out who's at fault after the fact. Like a... We'll just be upset and try to take care of it. Don't right, blame Steve. us. All right. Thank you.